Hey guys, Ross here at Blue Line Ball Pythons. We're cutting our first clutch of 2015. This is our Who's the Daddy clutch. It's uh, uh, possible pastel, possible inchy, could be bumblebee, um, could be super pastel. So we're going to cut these. It's day 53 and see how uh, what our odds were and how they came out. Uh, this is from a female, actually. We didn't uh, expect her to lay, uh, but she did, and uh, give us five really good eggs, um, and we're taking a look here to see what we get. So we're going to go ahead and pip them. I don't know what that is. It's hard to tell. Looks like a pastel. Almost looks like a like a pastel. This looks like almost maybe even a super pastel. Let's see if we can get some movement out of him. There he is, he's moving. There he is, he's alive. Okay, we just wanna make sure. He looks good. Very gently touching. That was kinda of hard one to pip. It's got, uh, it's real kinda of rigid, but we're not gonna mess too much. All right, moving on to the second one. We're gonna dispose of the old Q-tips. Here's our second one. This is a bigger one. So that almost looks like a super pastel. Or just a pastel. We'll see. I'm not 100% uh, sure. This is our first clutch here at Blue Line, so... Honestly, looks like another. Another pastel. Get a little more of this over here. All right, ready for number two. It looks like right now we've got Sue. I'm seeing super pastel because there's possible het pie. Yeah, possible het pie. So it'd be a 50% het pie, possible het pie. That came from our male um, pastel, 100% het pie, who's actually going to be the sire of our pastel pie clutch. So uh, we're going to move on. We've got two confirmed uh, healthy animals in there. It looks like they're moving and uh, very little uh, damage at all. They're uh, to their outer shell here, so pushing on to our number three.
That looks like... I don't know what that looks like. That's crazy. Maybe that's the Super Pastel. I haven't seen... Definitely unique. His body over there. Let's get a good look at him here. There's a head right there. We're looking at his mouth right there. See his head? We do. Let's show everyone else's head here. There's his mouth. Or her mouth. The mouth, I should Make say. Make sure she's, she's alright. She's alive and it's moving. Here we go. I think that's a super. Watch her. See it moving? Oh yeah. Hi baby. Ready for the world here. Moving on to egg number three, or four. number four. Looks like we've got two pastels and a super. I don't know, that might be a, I don't know if that's a super or not, but go ahead and cut this one. That looks like our normal. Yep, that's our normal. One out of four. It's awful light. But I think that's our normal. Let's do a test poke. Oh boy, yeah, lively. Can you get a picture? And this is our last egg. This is actually the largest egg of the whole entire clutch. So it looks like we've got a normal, uh, two pastels. Uh, one, I don't know if I want to call it a super pastel or if it's uh, something else, but it's got a really wicked pattern on it. So um, really, really light. Um, so almost, and surely it's not going to be a a bumblebee. It doesn't look like a bumblebee. Um, so we'll we'll figure it out, but I'm not going to push it any further than that. So this is our largest egg. This thing is really big compared to the clutch, uh, the other clutch mates and the other eggs. Um, this female actually, uh, we didn't anticipate again, we didn't anticipate her to lay, but she laid and um, she gave us some eggs. So and uh, we're not clear on who's the daddy on this one. We don't know. So um, at this point I'm going to say it's the pastel. Um, and that's the only pastel that we bred, so, to her. So let's see what we can come up with with this guy here. It's right on a crease. I'm gonna say that there's these are two super pastels. 
I'm going to say that's a super. And it's got a little more fluid than everybody else, so... I'm going to say that's a super pastel, possible het pied. And so is this one here. You kind of see a lot lighter. And if you compare with these... It's really hard to say. I mean, these look a little lighter, and they could all just be pastels too. So, we'll uh, we'll see what happens. We're gonna pop them back in here and uh, let them finish, and uh, hopefully we'll have some eggs uh, or some uh, snakes come out here. And uh, be sure to check our available uh, page on our website. It's www.bluelineballpythons.com. You can like us on Facebook. Subscribe to us on YouTube, um, and uh, again, look for our uh, availability page. Uh, we'll have some of these uh, animals up for sale, and uh, hopefully you enjoyed this as we did. We're really glad that this clutch uh, come out the way it did. Uh, we were excited either way. We didn't know, but we got us some super pastels possibly here, and uh, some het pied stuff. So, um, good start for our first clutch. Uh, very excited. Um, we've got pastel pieds brewing as we speak, so... Um, stay tuned to us, and uh, we'll uh, we'll check back in with all the progress, and uh, uh, keep you updated. Thanks for watching.